Hey, I'm Kier, and this is that vlog thing that I'm doing. Over the weekend, uh, there was an interesting uh, flash mob occurrence that happened. It's, it's been making the rounds on social media. Uh, it was a bunch of people that got together and got out in front of uh, where Dick Van Dyke was staying and performed a bunch of songs from Mary Poppins. Now, they did this because it was Dick Van Dyke's 90th birthday. And it was really pretty awesome because uh, he was singing right along with all of these, uh, all of these people. Uh, and he got down uh, into the crowd later on and was uh, singing with them and taking pictures with them and generally having a great time. Uh, and, you know... That's one of his iconic roles, and it's really kind of awesome to see that he is still known and loved and that uh, he's still around and sharp enough to be able to jump right back in to those old familiar songs and still show his appreciation for those who appreciate him. But the most important thing about this, the absolute most important thing, which I'm pretty sure most people don't know, is that this means that Dick Van Dyke is pretty much exactly the same age as my grandfather. Now, my grandfather isn't anywhere near as famous. Uh, he doesn't have a, didn't have a flash mob show up for his uh, birthday over the weekend. But he did turn 90, uh, and he's still going, uh, still going strong. He still works a couple days a week. Uh, he's on no medication whatsoever, which is nearly unheard of in this day and age. Uh, when he does get sick and goes into the doctor, they ask him what medications he's on, and he says none, and then they ask my grandmother if that's true. Because doctors can't believe that he is in as good health as he is in without being on medications, which I think says a little something about the general state of health in this country. Uh, but the simple fact of the matter is, he's still going pretty strong for a guy who just turned 90. Still smokes his cigars and drinks his, uh, drinks his Jack Daniels on a regular basis, uh, daily. Uh, so that's one of those iconic things for him, is, is the, uh, the good old cigar and, uh, rocks tumbler of, uh, uh, of Jack Daniels. But, uh, you know, 90 years, that's impressive. That's a long time. And he spent most of those years married to my grandmother. Uh, they, they've been married for um, 66 years now. They just had their anniversary not too terribly long ago. And that, to a lot of people... Uh, these days, especially a lot of younger people, people my age and younger, that's almost unbelievable that they're still together, that they still haven't killed each other. They've come close a couple of times. Uh, but, you know, what couple can be together that long without having some moments like that? I wasn't able to be up in New York for my grandfather's birthday. Uh, he's not online or anything like that, so it's not easy to just shoot him a quick message. Uh, but I want everyone to know that Joe Lubneski is, is a tough guy who's still around 90 years later, uh, 90 years after he was born. He's made it through a whole lot of history. He's still got more in him. Uh, and I'm looking forward to seeing him and the rest of the family uh, for Christmas this year. Here's to uh, another bunch of years. Let's go for at least an even century on, on that one. Who's your oldest family member right now? What, what kind of life have they lived? Are they still going strong? Let me know in the comments. Uh, I know that some people out there have some really uh, durable, long-lasting family members who, who've stuck around for a really long time, and even some of them who've done so and stayed in good spirits the entire time. I'm happy to say that my grandfather is still pretty much the same guy that I remember from growing up, and that's uh, that makes me happy. So let me know in the comments below. Tell me stories about your relatives. Good stories. I only want good stories this time around. Uh, if you like the stuff I talk about, give me a thumbs up down below the video. If uh, you're subscribed, thank you for being subscribed. If you're not subscribed, 
hit the subscription button so you get notified when uh, these things come out uh, every, every day, at least until the end of the year. And if you know anyone else who's interested in the stuff I talk about, share this or one of my other videos with them uh, and get them involved in the conversation. I'm Kier. That's it for today. Guess I'll see you tomorrow.